Hi and welcome to this demonstration video showing how SmartDose actually responds to a user's activity level. In this short video, we'll show you how SmartDose automatically adjusts the dose to match rest and exertion, giving more or less oxygen as needed. Here we have a webcam set up on Rich as he's sitting in a chair, reading a good book, and relaxing. At the same time, you can see part of the screen from our coder, which is sending oxygen volume data for each breath to the screen. So again, this is real time, and we're seeing the user and the dose volume on one screenshot. Notice the smart dose unit sitting on the floor to the right of Rich. Smart dose gives 16 ml per setting, and this unit is set on two, so he's getting a dose of 32 ml of oxygen on each breath. Now let's jump ahead and continue to watch. Okay, now we've jumped ahead about five minutes. We can see that while Rich was sitting, he got his normal dose of oxygen. But we can also see on the green chart at the bottom that as Rich gets up and moves to the treadmill, that his dose is changing. The dose is increasing due to his exertion. Smart Dose recognizes that he is now exerting and has increased the dose automatically. Now let's jump ahead again to see what happens as he continues to exercise. We've just jumped ahead five minutes and as you can see, Rich has continued to walk on the treadmill. You can see that his dose was higher throughout this period of time. Now as he stops exerting and moves back to a restful position, Smart Dose will also recognize this change and will bring the dose back down to the baseline value. This allows Smart Dose to give the best therapy and the best conservation. As you saw previously, Smart Dose will see the exertion very quickly and adjust up. However, on the transition to rest, the movement of the dose back down will have a little delay while the body recovers from the exertion. Okay, let's jump ahead yet again. As you can see, Smart Dose adjusted the dose back down to the base value as Rich has been sitting and is again at a 32 ml per breath setting. But let's look at this one more time. Rich will once again get up and start exercising. Notice how quickly Smart Dose reacts. From the time that he very first gets up to the time that the dose is increased is only seconds. This is what is revolutionary about Smart Dose. When patients titrate manually, they don't feel that they need an increase until they become symptomatic and then it's too late. They are already desaturated and breathless. Let's jump ahead one more time. Once again, the dose has remained higher as exertion has continued. As Rich gets off the treadmill and sits down, the dose will again come back down to baseline automatically. Smart Dose increases the dose at activity and decreases the dose at rest. And as you can see, the unit is very responsive and very consistent. No longer do your patients need to attempt to turn their oxygen up and down trying to hit that elusive just right timing. And no longer will your patients have to stop exerting because they waited until they were symptomatic to turn up their oxygen too late to be effective and no longer will your patients run through oxygen while sitting because they forgot to turn it back down when they sat down. Smart Dose does it all for them automatically and consistently. And there we have it. That's the quick demonstration of how Smart Dose auto adjusts to match the oxygen dose with the exertion level of the patient. If you're wondering just how it works, it monitors breathing patterns, establishes a patient's restful pattern, and recognizes the difference as patients move from rest to exercise and back again. For more information on Smart Dose or Inspired Technologies, please visit us at our website. And in the meantime, do the smart thing for your patients. Prescribe Smart Dose and ask for it by name.